we all went to Toys Us or Target uh, when the Phantom Menace came out. We bought Phantom Menace toys, but now we're like, uh -huh, I didn't buy any. Uh, my friend bought some, but uh, I was just there to watch him buy toys. I, I didn't like the Phantom Menace even before it came out. I knew it was going to suck, but that's not true. You liked the Phantom Menace when it came out. Don't sit there and bullshit me and say you didn't. You liked the Phantom Menace. You went to see it more than once. I don't care what you say. If you went to see a movie more than one time, you liked it. No one gives a movie theater there of what, $10, $12 for a movie, goes inside and said, man, this movie sucks. And it comes back two or three days and gives them another $20 and uh, watches it again. No, no. I mean, I've, I talk to these people all the time. Oh, I hate the Phantom Minutes, man. The Phantom Minutes blows, man. Man, I hate the Phantom Minutes, man. And I was like, oh, yeah, you hate them. You own it on DVD? Well, I'll get it on DVD and Blu ray. Yeah, I'll come. Okay. And you hated it, right? Yeah, I hated that, man. That movie sucked. How many times did you see it in the theater? Hmm. Let me see the fan, man. I saw it five times. And, uh, well, I saw it six saw it with my grandma one time. And then I went back and saw it twice and it was in 3D. No, okay, okay. Let me let me get this right. Let me let me get this straight. You hate the Phantom Menace. Oh yeah, yeah, I hate all the prequels. Okay, you hate the prequels. But you bought the DVD. And then we bought it again on the Blu-ray. Well, I bought the box set. It came with the Blu-ray. But uh, I had it on VHS. But, uh, you know, it wasn't on DVD then. So I have VHS, the DVD. And then I bought the uh, Blu-ray box set. And we, we did it in there. Okay. And then you, you went to see the movie uh, five times. Well, I saw it five times. But then I went back and saw it uh, another time with my granny. So I saw it six times. Okay. Six times. Then it, then it was re-released. Uh, re-released in 3D. And you saw it then too, right? Yeah, yeah. I saw it two times. I saw it, I saw it two times then. Okay, and, uh, and you hated this movie. Okay, let me see. Uh, so, so you saw it about six times. You owned the DVDs. You, you, uh, you got the toys. You probably uh, read the novel. Yeah, yeah, yeah I read the novel. Uh, okay, so let's see. Six times, watched the DVD, um, and and you hated this movie. Ah, oh, people, you didn't hate the movie. Sure few years after the movie came out the internet told you you hated it and you hated it sure okay I'm not gonna sit here and say the Phantom Menace was the best Star Wars movie ever created I'm not gonna say it's the best of the Star Wars movies there's a lot about the Phantom Menace I hate don't even get me started on a two-hour pod race oh, it looked good okay the pod race looked wonderful I will give you that it looked really good Ooh. Pod race. Hmm. It looked really good. I fell asleep during it the first time I saw it. But come on. You say you hate the Phantom Menace. Which in a Star Wars world, if you line up all the Star Wars movies, yes, you hate the Phantom Menace out of Star Wars movies. But you gotta admit, the Phantom Menace is better looking, more fun to watch. It's a better movie than, I would say, 85% of the movies that are out there. At least the summer movies. It's damn better than any Transformer movies. It's better than any G.I. Joe movie. And it's a hell of a lot better than that fucking Avatar. That's what these people that tell me, Oh, 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 oh I, hated, I hated the Phantom Menace. But, uh, uh what, what movie did you like? Oh, 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 I love, I love Avatar, man. Did you see that? No. My, I did see it. Wish I didn't see it. I almost walked out half of it. Me and my daughter was both about to pull our hair out. Guy, guy flew around on a bird for three hours. But, yeah, yeah, I saw that. But, uh, so, let me get this. So, the, so you saw The Phantom Man six times at the movie theater. Uh-huh. But, you saw Avatar. How many times did you see Avatar? Mm -hmm. I saw, I, saw, I saw it twice. I saw it twice. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, you have it on DVD and Blu-ray and VHS and all that? Well, I, I, I've got a DVD. I hadn't, I hadn't watched it yet. I hadn't, I hadn't, it's still in the shrink wrapper. So you bought Avatar after seeing it two times. You hadn't even watched it on DVD. But you have three copies of The Phantom Menace. Saw it six times, but you hate The Phantom Menace, right? Uh, yeah, The Phantom Menace sucks. Fucking Avatar sucks. You want to talk about what sucked? 
Now I'll give you, okay, I'll give you that. Maybe Avatar will look good. Who goes back and fucking watches Avatar? You know, you might have saw it once or twice. Ooh, you saw something in 3D. And so what? Okay, let's move on. But my point is, you don't hate the Phantom Menace. You may not like the Phantom Menace. You may not love the Phantom Menace. But you do not hate the Phantom Menace. Okay? You can hate it in a Star Wars sense. Compared to other Star Wars movies. But as a whole, you do not hate the Phantom Menace. I know you're going to reply down in the comments. Or you're going you're gonna to tweet me, Hey, Jumpman! I hate the Phantom Menace, man. I saw it... One time, and it was sucked in, and it sucked ever since then. I never saw it again. And I walked out of it before Anakin Skywalker even got to the pod race. Okay. Okay, I, I, I'll get that, and I'll let you I'll let you spew that. Uh, I don't believe you. You know, you might have been disappointed in it. Like I said, you may not have liked it in a Star Wars sense. But just admit you like the Phantom Menace. Can you? Can you at least say... You know, for those two hours and whatever, 20 minutes, I enjoyed myself watching the film. And that's all it takes. That's what I understand people's like, oh, uh, The Force Awakens just ripped off Star Wars A New Hope. So who gives a shit? Did you enjoy your movie when you watched it? Did you just sit down for two hours and enjoy the film? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But then when I got home, I got on Reddit, right? And they told me, that BBA is just R2D2. He's got plans in him like R2D2 does. <sighs> yeah. I don't know what this world's coming to. Okay? You go to a movie, you watch it, you like it. There's no, I went to a movie, you don't go to a movies, like a film, get home, go to Reddit, go to Twitter, go to the Star Wars message boards, and then hate a movie! That's not how it works. But no, that's the that's the age we live in. Ugh. Now we were talking about what we hate. I hated the Clone Wars. The movie, not the not the cartoon series. I hated the movie. And you're gonna say, well, but Junk Man, how can you hate it? It's a Star Wars movie. You said everybody likes Star Wars movies. Clone Wars ain't a Star Wars movie. I don't count it as a Star Wars movie. It's not part of the saga. It's stupid. It's a cartoon. It was made for TV. Yeah. It was made for TV and they decided, hey, let's just put it at the movie theater. Let's put two episodes together. Two or four episodes together. Whatever. Let's just put it on the TV and watch it. Let's just put it on TV. Let's just take the TV show, put it in the movie theater and get people to go see it. It fucking sucked. I'd rather watch Avatar backwards while somebody pissed in my eyes and watch that damn fucking Clone Wars movie again. It sucked. And uh, anyone that says it sucked, it sucked, okay? And I know uh, old Zach from uh, the podcast, he's going to tell you, well, the Clone Wars is probably the best Star Wars movie of all time. Sorry, Zach, that's my voice for you. I know you wouldn't say it was the best. But he says it's better than The Force Awakens. And I should tell you something right there. Let's get into this Force Awakens hate. Can't wait. I thought it was better than Return of the Jedi, personally. So, did a good job.